team in day one. And um, of course, today, it's, it's going to be another exciting um, afternoon with New Zealand playing India. And as you can uh, already see, New Zealand is here with a very young side. And uh, this looks like their future, but a very promising team. But Harman Preet still manages to find SV Sunil. Good ball forward, Talvinder now. Coming back, desperately trying to get across his Panchir. And he's done well to thwart the attack. And that was actually in the fourth test of the series. So it's been a while, a couple of years, since they've had a win in a major match. Very good uh, individual work into the D, earning a penalty corner. A very difficult jinking ball. Just hits the foot. Player number 23 of India, Pardeep Moore, giving New Zealand the first penalty corner of the day. Well, this is where they need to take advantage. They won two penalty corners in their match against Australia. Failed to convert either. Ross looking to stop, just shifted. They've gone instead. It's swept towards the goal. It was a good attempt from Sam Lane. But it was also a good save by PR Srijesh, the wall of India. Ball into centre field from Russell to find Elder. Elder, those pushed that a long way ahead of Russell. Russell at full stretch, kept it in play. Surges towards the deep. Good defending from Surrender. And it needed to be because lurking behind him, Panchir takes it early. Finds Janes. Janes managing to turn Rapinda Power. Reverse stick shot. Brilliantly shot and brilliantly saved by Srijesh. A very good quick pass by the captain to Janes. Harman Preet. Fires it across. SV Sunil gets there. It's not connected with, but it just rolls wide of Manchester's goal. SV Sunil with a great chance. Very well connected and a very quick shot. Just goes wide past Richard Joyce. Now they have low down with his stick in an indoor style tackle. Mandeep appealing for the free hit goes against Mandeep and he wasn't a required distance and he will get a card and that was silly from Mandeep green card so he will miss pretty much the first two minutes of the second quarter India down to 10 minutes Sumit picks out Sardar Sardar closed down by Prefia but he got the pass away and Joyce saves and it ricochets up into the air good save to deny Manpreet Jr. not related Newman cutting infield India getting through but it was a good pass but well cut out by Short into the D it goes and Mandy has got the final touch and what a finish by Mandy Singh he always seems to score the extraordinary goals he has a wonderful eye and that was another exquisite goal from Mandeep Singh. It was a brilliant goal. New Zealand is not happy at all. Akashdeep now weaving his way into the circle, looking for a foot. And a good work. It was Manpreet Jr. who in the end won the penalty corner. Manpreet injects. It goes to Harmanpreet. Harmanpreet low to the right. Joyce had gone down, but it creeps inside of the post. And it is 2-0 to India. Harman Preet, rarely does he show any emotion, and he won't like them ruffling his hair, I'm sure. But he smiles as he beats Joyce. On the first ball, well picked up. <laughs> Can't bring it under control. He's now inside the circle. The clock is running down. Needs to fire it across quickly. Does so, hit the foot again, but the Hooter goal line not kept in play by Pardeep Moore. So George Muir plays on for New Zealand. Mai Tai Wells has been kept a little bit quieter. He had a very big game against Australia. Been playing since the age of three. Very passionate about the sport. corner it goes yeah that's exactly I think uh, what Darren Smith is trying to do good chance though sorry interrupt SV Sunil into the oh that's not the sort of finish we expect from SV Sunil but it was a good interplay between him and Akash Deep and it earns the applause of Roland Altman's 
but it will be a long corner. Would have been a penalty corner if the umpire felt otherwise. And the hooter goes. They're looking for a third goal and to take this game out of the reach of the Black Sticks. I believe that there's a ball that touched the foot of the defender in the semicircle, earning India a penalty corner. And the green card has been issued. I think it's to Leo Mai Tai Wells. Waits to do the stopping. Mandeep lurking behind. Rafinda changes places. Harman Preet sweeps high. Harman Preet sweeps into the net. It is 3 0 to India. Harman Preet gets his second of the match and his second of the tournament. Very well stopped. Picked up by Harman Preet. Top right. No chance for Divan Manchester saving that movement. Look at uh, the strength and the pace. And Manpreet Jr. couldn't bring it under control at the top of the circle. And so breaking forward is Wilcox. And Manpreet runs across him. And here may be the card that I was saying. He so regularly picks up on the chair by the umpires. A, a, a breakdown of play made by Manpreet Jr. in this instance. India has to play with 10 players the last one minute and 55 seconds. Three seconds remaining. The Indian fans are already celebrating the Hudiga.